So we know that reforming our health insurance system will be a critical step in rebuilding our economy so that our entrepreneurs can pursue the American dream again and our small businesses can grow and expand and create new jobs again. Grandparents and relatives who step in to care for wounded warriors and folks trying to carry on after losing the person they love most in the world. And through it all, these families somehow... But all this was just one step in the broader effort to grow our economy and shrink our deficits. We during, the during a recession of this severity, it is important, as I explained, for the government to step in and fill the, the hole in demand that was created by consumers and by businesses to get the economies kick-started. But Brown was, of course, the first major step in dismantling the separate but equal doctrine. But it would take a number of years and a nationwide movement to fully realize the dream of civil rights for all of God's children. While we have a long way to go to end this waste once and for all, the legislation I'm about to sign is a very important step in creating a government that is more efficient, more accountable, and more responsible in keeping the public's trust. So one First of all, my mom, who through all of these years, after having brought us into the world, still finds a way to help us take that next step in a very difficult world. As this is an essential step in advancing a positive, constructive, and comprehensive relationship between our countries. Um, if taxpayers ever have to step in again to prevent a second Great Depression, the financial industry will have to pay the taxpayer back every cent. That legislation is an important step in the right direction, but... These properties have already identification, been identified. Identification is just the first step in the process. As I mentioned, there are... There's Step in. You need to be here. I've been here. This is an important step in NSF's quest, the administration's quest, and really everyone's quest to establish a better balance between the responsibilities and demands of work lives and family lives. It came around because as a country, as a United States of America, we decide you know what? When any part of the country gets in trouble, we're going to step in and help out. That's and I intend to keep fighting for this kind of balance and fairness. That would be a huge step in that integration that we are looking for and that we have all identified as necessary. So today, the United States and the European Union agreed to take the next step in our work towards the possible launching uh, of negotiations on an agreement to strengthen our already very deep trade and investment partnership. Uh, Becoming a citizen, he says, is another step in the right direction for my family. So today we congratulate Francisco Balesteros de la Rosa. Today marks the next step in a new chapter between the United States and Burma. Now Kenya must take the next step in March with the first national elections under your new constitution. Your visit is a historic step in that direction. This would be another major step in integrating our two economies and positioning us to compete in the fastest growing markets in the world, those in the Asia Pacific region. We to cut through red tape that keeps big construction projects from getting off the ground. Now, I, some of you, if you've heard me, I'm really, it's a significant step in the reduction of carbon emissions. And what the government can do is to step in to make sure, for example, that there's still a 30-year mortgage available, mm -hmm. uh, to make sure that uh, homes that are not too upscale uh, are available for young families, for veterans, uh, for uh, you know, folks who may have some limited means but uh, have saved and scrapped and mm -hmm. uh, are ready to go out there and buy. Uh, but, you know. So today I'm proud to announce the next step in this fight. We're That's an important step in our fight against climate change. Uh, and over the weekend we took an important step in that direction uh, towards moving serious chemical weapons under international control so that they can be destroyed.
The good news is, this morning, the Senate took a very important step in that direction. Uh, for the Moreover, after an extended review of our use of drones in the fight against terrorist networks, I believed a fresh examination of our surveillance programs was a necessary next step in our effort to get off the open-ended war footing that we've maintained since 9-11. Geneva is a possible step in the right direction, but we will have to make headway.